Hey guys, CERN here. Uh, today, I'm gonna be going over a topic about I Fap Illini, also known as I Fly Illini. This video will be put up on the three Bobos. I'm gonna try and do another commentary right after this that'll go up on my <laughs> Paritana. Let's get right into it. This is uh, gameplay on Mall for 3, Call of Duty Mall for 3, obviously. With the MP7 extended mags, rapid fire, simtex, portable radar, and my perks are scavenger. I really don't know my other perk. I'm pretty sure it's scavenger, assassin pro, and something else. I couldn't see what it was. So scavenger, assassin pro, and it keeps lagging. I believe it's a silent or whatever the hell that perk is, I can't remember what it's called, I never play Mall for 3 out, like, I basically only play Mall for 2 because, uh, that's just, like, my favorite game, my favorite Call of Duty is Mall for 2, it's the best Call of Duty, and I'm pretty sure it always will be, I mean, the, the way that all these games have been going since Mall for 2, all the Call of Duty games since Mall for 2, they're, they're pretty much sucking dick, and they're not fun at all, so, Pretty sure Mall for Two is gonna stay my favorite game overall. Uh, but yeah, uh, we're, I'm gonna be going over a topic about uh, I Fly Line I. Uh, I don't even know where to begin. Okay, I Fly Line I was a YouTube commentator. He didn't really have that many subscribers. Then uh, there was another YouTube commentator named Raw Instincts, he had a lot of subscribers. He had like, how many, he had like, th either 200 or 300,000 subscribers. Uh, now around this time, he had, e I can't remember whether it was 200,000 or 300,000, so I'm just going to say 200,000, or 300,000, I'm just going to say 300,000. He, he put up a video called, uh, my setup video. Thanks for 350,000 subscribers. And then this is this is the beginning of the time where I Fly Illini released a video about Raw Instinct. Raw Instinct uh, didn't steal videos, but basically copied the idea of them. He took the idea that came from the video and used it in his own videos. I Fly Illini made a video about it and called him out on it. Uh, I Fly uh, I Fly Illini supposedly put a lot of work in his videos and Raw Instinct stole one. It's not really stole it, but stole the, uh, the whole idea of it. And since he has more subscribers than I Fly Illini, uh, I Fly Illini didn't get any, any, you know, uh, what's it called? Didn't get any respect, or didn't get any, uh, I don't know how to, I can't, did the words, like, right on the tip of my tongues, it, it, Rotten Sink didn't tell any of his subscribers or any of the viewers that he got the idea from, uh, from I Fly Illini. I can't remember what that word is, what it's called, like, when you don't get acknowledged for doing something. Uh, whatever. Uh, <laughs> The word isn't acknowledged, by the way. It's like a different word, but I can't remember it. But he didn't get any, uh, he didn't get any respect for the, his, his own idea, which, uh, Raw Instinct took from him. So, I fly line, I made a video on how Raw Instinct steals people's videos and lies to subscribers and viewers talking about, uh, other people's topics. He talk he... It talks about how other people's topics, how he stole videos from T. Martin and other big YouTubers. And there was a lot of evidence showing that he actually did steal, uh, actually did steal a lot of videos. Not, when I say steal, I don't mean downloading the video and uploading it and saying it's your own. I mean stealing the idea, okay? So, I know saying steal is just like a very broad topic, but when I say steal, that's basically what I mean, uh, so there is a lot of evidence, and there's a lot of po people pointing fingers at Raw Instinct. Since that video was released, uh, Raw Instinct was at 350,000 subscribers when the video was released. 
after the video was released, now he's at 320,000. He has lost a lot of subscribers since that video. But then, that was about four months ago, three months ago, four months ago, something like that. But then, just recently, I Fly Line I was found beating off on a gay. I don't, I don't know how to explain it. Gay website for men or whatever. It's the website is called Chatterbait. I, by the way, I don't, I don't freaking go on that website. The only reason I know it is because of information that I've heard and things being passed around or whatever. <laughs> That's how I know the website. He was seen on the, a website called Chatterbait. It's where men, you know, pleasure themselves while other people watch them and they get paid to do it. I have no idea what was in I Fly Lion Eye's mind. I don't know why he would do this. He's uh, he's in the Air Force. He's a big ass commentator on YouTube. He gained like 80,000 subscribers just from that video that he put out about Raw Instinct. So I have no idea what would make him go do this. I don't. Know. Obviously, it wasn't for the money. Maybe something is just wrong in his head. I mean, <laughs> he was making plenty of money from the Air Force and YouTube. Uh, but anyways, whoever whoever found him was obviously watching him and on the gay website. Uh, whoever found him doing it uh, took pictures or whatever and sent it to his friends. Well, first of all, they made a fake account on Facebook and sent it to his friends, family, and um, and Air Force buddies or I don't know what they call them. I'm pretty sure it's just Air Force buddies. And all of the people in a s s whatever squad, I don't know, but it sent it to almost all of his friends on Facebook. So now his life is basically ruined. He, uh, I fly a line, I lost so much respect. He put out a video after the rumor got around, and it was severely disliked. It, like, it was crazy. Like, it, it was just <laughs> disliked to the point where it, there's no point in putting up a video because, you know, you just. <laughs> got all those dislikes so I fly line I then shut his YouTube account down shut his YouTube account down shut his Facebook down shut his Twitter down and he's just gone no one no one knows where he is in, in you know inter internet aspects or whatever no one knows where he's gone he could still be doing it I don't duck and know I don't go on the website and look okay so now that I fly line eyes gone, he was caught, you know, beating it or whatever. Now Raw Instinct is back. There's been so many, t uh, t you know, uh, videos posted about this whole situation. It's just been absolutely insane. It's been crazy. Uh, it's just so, like, not re he's not really a hypocrite because like that doesn't make sense, but like. So Raw Instinct does something wrong, and then, you know, I Fly Line Eye does something completely wrong that, like, what are you doing, dude? I mean, if you're that bad in the economy, I guess you could just go beat it on the internet, you know, for money, but... <laughs> it's just, it's, now that Raw Instinct back, he's obviously gaining subscribers again because of the whole I Fly Line Eye situation, and... I, I don't know if Ron Sinks learned his lesson. He's probably going to keep stealing videos like he always has, you know. Uh, I, I would like to see what happens in the future because you never know. Maybe, I mean, Ron Sinks is still getting a shitload of hate, but he's also getting a lot of likes and comments at the same time because of the whole situation. Uh, if you look, he's posted two videos since he's been back. Uh... One is a gameplay about this situation that I'm talking about right now, and the other I don't even know. I just went on it and disliked it. Because I do not support, you know, thieves. Not thieves, you know, is a broad topic to talk about, but the thieves as in video ideas. I don't, like, I know it's not right to just go on the video immediately and dislike it, but I guarantee you that's what half of the people did that watched it. When you do something wrong and then come back in the community expecting everyone to like you again, 
just because the person that called you out did something bad. That's not how it works. No, like, of course there's gonna be people like that, but <laughs> a majority of the community is not gonna be like that. They're gonna keep disliking you, and you're not gonna get anywhere. But that's, uh, that's all I gotta talk about. I just think that it wasn't right for whoever saw I Fly Illini doing it to send it to all of his friends, family, and stuff. Like, that, you basically ruined his life right there. That's all I gotta talk about. Talk to you guys later.